already thought our daughter was amazing, but when she went through her cancer journey, I mean, with such faith, with such grace, with such dignity, she never complained. You know, here's a child, you know, very athletic, very active, bedridden, you know, after her first week of diagnosis with cancer. And she still chose to live and still chose to see the best in life. And it was just amazing to watch. I mean, she was just amazing, like a force. A big part of who we are is, uh, like part of our vision is to give encouragement to people and to be part of a community. Every day we get so busy with just the operations of things like, you know, running the website, boxing up the orders, running the shop, that sometimes we don't really get to do what we love to do, which is um, like build relationships with people and get into their homes and um, like be a part of their lives. So for us, we just wanted to do this for somebody just so that we could do exactly what our vision is, which is to help other people and to bless other people. We all fell in love with Lucretia and Dustin and their story, and so that is why we're here. I can see why the community has completely wrapped around them. I mean, we've only gotten to spend a little bit of time with them, but they are just really, really special people. Um, I can't imagine the pain that they go through every day, but they're still really plugging forward and looking for purpose in their lives. Destiny was their only child, and she was their everything. I'm Lucretia Rickenberg. Uh, we live in Pelham, Alabama. And this is I'm husband. Dustin Rickenberg, and I also reside in Pelham, Alabama. I happened to see the giveaway, and I was like, I think I'm going to enter this. And it was weeks, right, where I kept saying, I got to do the video, I got to do the video. And um, I went to my, we call them faith bookers, the people that have followed us through Destiny's Journey. I said, hey, I've entered this contest. Y'all go and check it out. You know, if you like my video, vote for me. And so they all came through and I won. <laughs> so I'm so excited. We came out to Alabama and uh, right now what we're doing is we're decorating two rooms in their home. We're doing the guest bedroom and uh, we're kind of just giving it like a complete overhaul. And then another room that we have, which is pretty small, so it's not gonna take uh, all of our time. And so we kind of did two rooms, is a memorial room that we have for Destiny. It's a room for their parents to go in there and grieve and to just kind of have peace because obviously it's been a really hard journey. Yeah, it's, it's kind of like, you know, when she was here, your motivation was stimulated based on cars, clothes, school, activities. Um, and that, that was the motivating factor to want to be the best, right? That's why I wanted to promote, that's why I wanted to develop and ultimately make as much money as I could because, you know, it's transitions to her. <laughs> and, uh, you know, when she left, the motivating factor is she had such high expectations and now she gets to live and see them every single day. So like I, I represent her every day I wake up and um, I can take her to work with me every single day and show people that it's a choice. Every day you wake up, you have an option to make the most of it, you know? And uh, I live, you know, focused on purpose and value. Um, she just beat me there, you know? Throughout her journey, like she taught me, okay, mom, it's okay to cry, you know? And I love when we cry together. You know, and so like, I rarely cried through her, through her journey because I was in fight mode and I was like, we're gonna beat this. But when she passed, I'm like, gosh, I've, I've never cried so much in my life. So, um, you know, it's hard for me. It is so hard because, you know, my best friend, my little buddy, she's gone, you know. I'm not, uh, I'm not only grieving, you know, the loss of her, but I'm grieving like the life she would have had here that I don't get to see. So it's very tough for me. Um, but this one here has been my rock. He's absolutely amazing. Like, cause I just knew this was going to destroy him because their relationship, they were like two peas in a pod. They were like, they were just the father daughter bond was amazing. And he just stepped up and just has been a rock. 
I mean, he inspires people through his job, with her story, um, and you've just proven that you're so much stronger than you thought you were. And I appreciate you. I love you. You can edit that part out. <laughs> <laughs>